Hi, uh, today I want to show you how I made an origami penguin sculpture. Uh, I received a direct message from one of my subscribers on my Instagram. The idea was to make a, this sculpture of two penguins uh, in origami style, like uh, my Rhino 2.0 sculpture. He sent me some references, some photos of penguins. We discussed the price and then started to work. I start with a few paper sketches to understand the overall shapes. The next step is sculpting. I always use oil wax based clay like plasticine. It's important to use sulfur free clay because silicon product will not cure if you use clay with sulfur. After the clay sculpture is ready, I begin preparing it for casting. These small elements will help a lot. I use two component silicone rubber for mold. I usually apply about three to four layers. You need to wait for silicone to cure before the next layers. After the silicone has cured, I remove all excess parts, then cut out and remove small clay elements. One of the most important steps is to decide how many parts of the shell there will be, so it can be opened later. I mark parts with permanent marker. Applying plaster. I let each part of the shell cure before starting working with the next part. Don't forget to apply some lubricant like Vaseline on the contact edges where two parts meet. I recommend to keep the plaster shell with clay sculpture inside overnight. Then beginning to disassemble. Remove excess elements from the silicone mold with small scissors. Of 
Assembling cluster shell with silicon inside with a rope. I'm using small pieces of thick wire to tighten the rope. I'm using the Portland cement. It will cure in about 12 hours. I recommend to shake shell well after pouring cement inside to get rid of air bubbles. Disassembling on the next day. In this case, there is not much to correct, so I skip to varnishing. I am using woodwork varnish. My sculpture is finally ready. Thank you for watching, I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you follow me on Instagram for more of my work. And I'll see you in my next videos.